Today we learn five basic concepts of keyframe in CapCut. In this tutorial, we covered the following concepts, which will help you master your editing skills. Before we dive in, we should know what keyframe is. Keyframes let you animate any element, text, video, stickers, by setting start and end points. Keyframe fills in the motion between them. Keep watching till end to master your skills. And don't forget to subscribe the channel. Let's start the tutorial. There is a YouTube PNG logo in overlay that will move from left to right with the help of a keyframe. Add keyframe at the starting point. Add another keyframe as per your need in the end portion of the overlay. Select the overlay and move the PNG to the left corner as per your need. To give a more smooth look to the animation, go to the graph and select the template as per your need. Same process can be applied for while using the keyframes for vertical and horizontal movements of any object or elements. In case of any confusion, you can share your feedback in the comments section. Just showing a demo, how you can create your imagination with using keyframes. Let's jump to the zoom in and out concept. You can often catch the most popular stuff in the animated realm coming out on Instagram, TikTok, or Facebook. They use the zoom function all the time. To apply the zoom in and out effects, select overlay and apply. Keyframe at the starting point and zoom. The clip as per your need at the ending point of your frame. Same process will apply for zoom in and out effects. You need to understand how keyframe behaves and how you can use it to create your content in an eye-catching style. Rotation effect. Add keyframe at the starting point and zoom the screen at midpoint to create an impact on the clip. And in the end, as per your need, rotate the screen. Fade in and out effects. Apply keyframe on opacity. You can change so many things in your content. Here is one of the examples for your view and understanding. If you are still connected with the tutorial, I am sure you already understand what keyframes are and how they work. I would request you to share your feedback on the comment about the tutorial. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe the channel. Magnifier effect. It is one another example to understand that you can use keyframe magic while using the video effects or animation on your content. I am sure this tutorial helps you to understand the basic concepts of keyframe and how you can apply to create stunning and professional videos for your content. If you like the tutorial, don't hesitate to subscribe to the channel. For more topics, please comment for the next tutorial you want to learn.